While getting ready for this next video, it hit me that we're not perfectly bulletproof, and chances are I'll probably miss all the scenarios that would make us bulletproof. But I want to point something out here with this file. Um, we've been diligent in checking that everything is in order like so, but we haven't been diligent about checking whether there's more data in the file or not. Now, I know our code uh, is written in a way that the, it won't add superfluous data to the file, meaning we're not going to get bibbidi-bobbidi-boo out here like so. But it is possible that we do something wrong and we think we have only five frames, but yet we have maybe six or seven or twenty or two billion, that sort of thing. So we didn't check to ensure that we were at the end of our file when we're done checking that we have all the correct data. We need to add a check and ensure that we're at the end of the file and nothing else has been written. We need to do that in, uh, in both cases. So I think what we'll do here is add another function, It'll be a help function, helper function, I'll say bool uh, is at end of file. Uh, if stream reference input. Now the way the C++ file streams work is say I had some data, let's just say this is a bunch of data in my file and we read and we read and we read and we read. As long as the there's data to read and I'm reading it correctly. Um, the file stream will always return good. It will return true when I call good, which returns the status of the good bit. Okay, everything's good, 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 good going along. And I can read all the way up to the end of the file and it will still be good at this point. But once I try to read past this, all of a sudden good will return false. All right, so all of our tests so far We've assumed that we're reading everything good, we're right, and we've, we're at the end of the file. Well, I want to do one just extra read past the file and, and ensure that the file's good bit gets turned off. So that's what we are going to do here. First of all, I'm going to say if not input dot good, meaning everything should be good at this point, return false. All right, we're not at the end of the file. Something bad happened up to this point. We might be at the, at the end of the file. We may have tried to read way past the end of the file. All right, but either way, uh, that's not what you're expecting. Okay, everything should be good up to this point. All right, and if it's not good, then I'm going to tell you there's a problem. All right, let's do char bit bucket. Just uh, I want. To, I just want to read one character. I want to try to go one character past the end of the file. And then I want to return not input dot good. Now look at me being a show off with my Boolean logic. But basically, the good bit should be bad now. We tried to read past the end of the file. And it shouldn't be good anymore. Right? And that's what we want. That's what we expect. So it should not be good. And that should be true, which means we're at, this was at the end of the file. We are at the end of the file. Okay, there's my logic right there. So now, in check samples, I'm just, all I really need to say is expect true uh, is at is atty is at end of the file input. I'm just going to add that there. And unfortunately, I'm adding tests after we've written all the implementation and made the test pass. But I just want to verify that's true. Control F5 build succeeded good that that passed. Now how can I verify that what I just added is actually doing what I expected it to do? What a, adding this blah 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 this this test so to say. Well, that should be pretty straightforward. I hope um, down here in write samples, I'm going to just add one more row profiler dot new frame profiler dot add entry uh, categories sub zero and I'll just put a 100 here control L control VVV and I learned in the last video 
do one, two. So I'm doing the three categories to force the compiler to write out that last frame. And at that point, we should not be at the end of the file anymore. So this test I've just made bogus. But I want to verify to myself that, that yeah, this is doing exactly what I expected it to do. And we're no longer going to be at the end of the file when we do hit this line. So let's control the five, run that. And sure enough, we have a failure. Let's ensure that... Uh, right here, value of is at end of file. We got a false. We expected it to be true. So very good. I'm feeling good about that. I'm going to take this trash code out now that I just added. I'm just control Z through this. Control F5. Be sure that I get all green and we're still good. Okay, good time to commit and uh, move on.